got Linda on the line. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So what seems to be the problem? I recently changed surgeries and went for my first um, smear test with them. Um, they tried it on three occasions using two different instruments. It was so painful that I screamed the surgery down. Oh. They're now talking about oestrogen cream or possibly having it done at the hospital, which will make it even more painful. So I'm not quite sure whether or not to go ahead, go ahead and just ignore it. OK. I ignore well, it and just... not have the smear? Exactly, which is yeah. Not right. Which is not the best option. No, definitely not. No, no I mean... P smear tests are painful for everyone, we know that, but they become much more painful when you're going through the menopause because you have a reduced amount of oestrogen, which may means that the vaginal wall becomes very thin and dry. And so that's why you've been suggested to try the oestrogen um, creams or, or pessaries. Now that will help bring the moisture and thickness back to the vagina and it will allow that pain to be dissipated. I really wouldn't worry about the kind of side effects that I, I know that sometimes you can be concerned by when it comes to oestrogen because um, often it's a very small amount that gets absorbed into the body. And so you may not get any of the side effects and you only have to do it for two weeks before the smear test. So I'd give it a go and see how you get on with it. OK. Do you have a second opinion on that one? I mean, I think the, the main priority is you do have the smear test and whatever avenues you need to take in order to make sure you do that because, believe me, although it's a bit painful and uncomfortable, if there was something untoward going on and you didn't find out about it in the early stages, you know, just think about how you'd feel afterwards. And distract yourself. Like, it's like, go on your phone, just sit there and look at something. Start reading something while it's all going on. Mm. You don't have to talk to the person, just sit there and look at your phone and just do like that. Just think, try and think about something else. And another yeah. tip, actually, it was a friend who told me this. Think about wiggling your toes. I don't know, worth a try. Oh. Like any distraction, distraction technique. Good luck, but do go and do it. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much indeed, Linda.